Kathy, today Governor Abbott's expected to sign into law a controversial voting reform bill. That bill will tighten voting rules in Texas. Our Brittany Jeffers is at a polling location this morning that will be impacted by that new law. Live in Pasadena for us. Brittany, good morning. And good morning to you. Well, this spot will be directly impacted because this is one of those 24-hour polling spots that was used in Harris County. But under this new bill, that will not be allowed. There's also several other uh, big changes that will be coming. Now, go ahead and take a look. This is some video from the drive through voting location at the Toyota Center. Well, SB1 will ban both drive through and 24-hour voting, both of which were used during the pandemic in Harris County. The bill also restricts restricts early voting hours from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. across the state, but requires at least 12 hours of early voting per day for counties with more than 55,000 people. SB1 also bans sending mail-in ballot applications unsolicited and adds additional ID requirements. So this means that voters must provide their driver's license number, or if they don't have one, the last four digits of their social security number on applications for ballots. There's also some more protections for poll watchers and new requirements for those who assist voters fill out their ballots. For instance, the person who's assisting must now fill out paperwork disclosing their relationship to the voter. They must also recite an expanded oath saying they didn't pressure or coerce the voter into choosing them for assistance. Now, right now, the governor is scheduled to sign this bill in East Texas uh, with uh, the authors of the bill. That will happen around 11 o'clock today. Reporting live this morning from Pasadena, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News. Pretty thanks.